All right, guys, I am excited. We are back in Canton at the at-home store. I think they have all their Halloween stuff out now. If not, a good portion of it. I saw some inflatables the other day, so we're going to go on in here, check it out, and see what all they have. Thank you, Automatic Doors. Oh, yeah. Okay, they definitely don't have it all out, but they do have more than the last time we were in here. Let's start with these inflatables, guys. Look at this. This is so cool right here. <laughs> A 12-foot inflatable Happy Pumpkin. I've seen the ones that are 12-foot, but there's like, you know, kind of like this stacked up but I don't think I've ever seen one that's just one giant happy pumpkin. That is cool, I would love to have that. And right beside it, we got the awesome Happy Halloween Pumpkin Archway. Now this is only nine feet, but that's still cool. I love how there's so many. That's awesome. Peanuts, we got uh, Snoopy on his doghouse as the Red Baron. Let's see, eh, nobody wants a turkey. <laughs> this is kind of cool ten and a half feet long happy Halloween with a ghost look at his tail how it wraps around the front there happy Halloween jack-o-lantern skeleton dog that's cool that's only four feet tall look at this one. Oh, this is awesome zero up on top of the pumpkin that is cool that's only three feet tall though I would love that if it was a lot bigger pumpkin boy Halloweeny dog, look at that. That's hilarious. Look at this one, guys. Spider with witch hat. That is pretty awesome. <laughs> it's a pumpkin spider with a witch hat. And it's five feet tall because of the witch hat. Look at that. That is too funny. Top hat ghost. Look at the bats on his hat. That's funny. Black and purple winged dragon, three and a half feet tall. That dragon looks familiar, like it's from a kid's movie or something. But I just can't place it right off. A couple of pumpkins here. Black cats. I wonder if that's animated. A lot of time, I don't think so. A lot of times these black cats that are just like this, the head will at least go back and forth and sometimes the tail. That's pretty cool though. It's only 15 bucks. Alright, let's see. Here's a big pumpkin, a five foot pumpkin. There's that one again. Oh, we got Sally here. Three and a half feet tall. Holding a pumpkin. Pumpkin with a black cat. Uh, let's see, pumpkin and black cat. Oh, yes, we got a spooky tree. You gotta love the spooky tree, guys. Twelve feet tall. I love that thing. I think it was uh, Lowe's or Home Depot last year. Had one that was like that, only it had jack-o-lanterns on the uh, on the arms and it was pretty cool but I love that a couple more up here but I think we've seen them skeleton dog pumpkin boy Halloweeny dog there's some of them blown up on top oh there's the cat and he's not moving so that's the answer to that one let's go around here a second I love that spider pumpkin right there that is hilarious Okay, let's go right over to the end here and start and work our way down. It looks like there's about five aisles, guys. Ooh, look, we got even more over here, so we'll go over there in a minute. Some of this we saw the first time we were in here. I don't know if we saw this. Look at this. <laughs> look at the lights in his eyes. Look at the beak. That's hilarious. I don't think we saw that the first time we were in here. Look at the skull candles. I love those. Oh, here we go, guys. Bleeding taper candles. They're white, but when you light them, the wax that runs down is red like blood. That is so cool. I love those. What is this? Couple of banners. 63 inch banners. Welcome ghouls, or ghouls welcome, however you want to say it. That's pretty cool. Eternal Flame Crematorium. That's cool. Haunted house, enter if you dare. I'm too sexy for my skin. <laughs> <laughs> the
This one I know we saw last time. Yeah, the lights light up. That's pretty cool. I really like that one. And of course we got the scary tree. Or no, no, I called it a tree the last time, but it's actually a candle. Look at how the lights, how they change colors. That's pretty cool. Okay, let's keep on moving here. We didn't see these dogs last time. Ooh, and they got a button too. Let's see what they do. Ooh, the eyes light up. Look at that. That is spooky. I love that. Red velvet skull. That is pretty cool right there. Black skull. Oh, we saw this one too. Yeah, it has the gem eyes. Ooh, don't drop it there. Okay. Let's see. Silver pumpkin. Look at this wreath. Skull. Skeleton hands. Okay, let's see. Oh my gosh. I don't know if we saw this guy last time or not. Look at his face. <laughs> that is too funny. Oh my gosh. This is cool, a barware set. Look at that with the skulls. Those are metal too, those aren't even plastic. That's cool. I think we saw this one last time too. Yeah, I remember how that lit up, that's cool. And these books, they open up to hide stuff. Look at this guy sitting on his throne. That's pretty creepy. His, his, his uh, sword is made of bone too. Don't be a scaredy cat, keep it spooky. They did not have this stuff out the last time, or at least they didn't have these. This is so cool. <laughs> a giant Jack Skellington, you gotta plug him in. But I don't think they had that out last time. I wish there was somewhere I could plug him in. I'd love to see that guy lit up. We got some pumpkin stacks here. These also light up, you gotta plug them in. Here's a pumpkin. This might be one of those that's carvable. It's like foam but you can actually carve a face in it and make it light up if you want to. Here's our evil hounds. Buster Bones is his name. <laughs> That's too funny. All right, oh man, do I love Halloween. I know it's only July, guys, but dang, Halloween is so much fun. Haunted Valley Cemetery, come and stay a while. <laughs> Look at this. This one looks like a giant greasy cup. Spooky bat. Ooh. Spooky Sparkle Spider. Spooky Sparkle Spider. Please don't wake the bed. The, please don't wake the dead. They are grumpy. <laughs> oh my god, look at the giant eyes. You just stick them in the ground. It's nothing but eyes. Oh, this scarecrow guy is totally awesome. I wonder if he lights up. No, I guess not. If he does, there's got to be like a button somewhere, but I don't see one. But he is rad anyway. Skeleton bats. It's a full size, I mean not a full size, but it's a full skeleton with bat wings. Just imagine those things flying at you in the night. Oh sweet, it lights up too. Yes, look at those eyes. <laughs> Spooky. I'm gonna have nightmares of running from scads of those things flying at me and chasing me. Another light up, probably the eyes. Uh oh! I think he's yelling, help me. Sir, you're already dead. Okay, then we got the Nightmare Before Christmas stuff. We did see this uh, in our last trip, but I love Zero, man. Zero is the coolest ever. That is so awesome. <laughs> Look at his pumpkin nose, that's hilarious. Oogie Boogie, Jack, and Sally. This is Halloween, weenie, 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 weenie. Okay, now that I have that song stuck in my head. Oh, look at this, Halloween pumpkin decorating kit. You stick these in the pumpkin. <laughs> look at this, guys. <laughs> oh my God, it's hilarious. Look at this wreath with the eyeballs in it. That's pretty spooky. If one door closes and another one opens, your house is probably haunted. This mummy guy here, pretty spooky. Ooh, we got foam headstones down here. Look at this one. This is one of those, it's like a groundbreaker, I think. You set it up and then you stick the arms and the legs, if legs are there. Just arms, I guess. Stick them in the ground. Yeah, look at this. Hold on, let me show you. Hold on now. There you go. Yeah, stick it in the ground like he's coming out. 
raising from the grave. Gosh, it's like the evil iguana. <laughs> Look at this thing. <laughs> that is hilarious. Mummy hand lawn stakes. Basically the same thing as the groundbreaker uh, skeleton. You stick them in the ground like there's a mummy coming out of the ground. White pumpkin. Orange pumpkin. Wait, we gotta try me here. Short circuit lights. Ooh wee! Oh look! It makes like a storm. That's really cool. You know what you could do with that, guys? Have you ever seen those storm clouds that you make and you could like hang over your bed? You just make it with foam or not foam, um, like cotton. Just big pieces of cotton. You make it look like a big uh, cloud, and then you put those in it. And when you turn it on, it becomes a thunderstorm right in your bedroom. Look at this, we got a projection, shadow lights. This is gonna be sweet. Ooh, look at that. I love stuff like that. And it shines up here. Wait, we have more up here. Okay, hold on, maybe we can see this one better. Let's do this one. There we go. That is pretty cool. You could put that in the middle of the room and it would shine that stuff all over the whole room on all the walls and the ceiling. Pretty cool. Here's one that's Nightmare Before Christmas. Let's see what's on that one. Yes, look at that. That is cool. <laughs> Whirl emotion. Wait a minute, try me. Okay, there we go. These are the ones I think that you, um, you stick in the ground and it shines up, yeah, onto your house. So that's what would shine up onto your house right there. Do it one more time. There we go. Ghosties! These I just absolutely love. I'm really tempted to buy some of these and make one of those storm clouds. That would be so cool. We got giant ground breakers here. Welcome signs. Those are pretty cool. Look how big they are too. That's got to be about four feet tall. Okay, they got a bunch of this stuff that you stick in your front yard, like in a little garden area and stuff, just for, just to have something out there that's uh, fall-like or Halloween-y. Same thing over here. You gotta love this, though. Look, this reminds me of the old, uh, ouch, the drawing books that I used to get at the, at the uh, library. Ed Emberley was the name of the artist, and he showed you how to draw stuff like this. I loved that. That's actually my favorite kind of Halloween stuff right there. You know, even like all the monsters and stuff are cool and the animatronics are awesome. I love to get scared by them, but just classic fun party stuff for kids. That's what I absolutely love. Dancing pumpkin. Oh crap, what's it called? Dancing skeleton. <laughs> Tipping his hat. Sparkly boo. All right, I know we have more down here. We got a couple, uh, couple more aisles to go. Holy crap, we got some awesome stuff down here, but hold on. I think we saw this one the last time we were here. The silvery hand holding this guy that lights up. Hold on, watch. Yeah, look at that. That is cool. Look at the skull. That's pretty awesome. What is this? Celebrate Halloween. It's the most spooktacular time of year. Yes. Here's a spooky mirror. Hello. Spooky cauldron. Spooky pumpkin. <laughs> Oh yeah, it's October, witches! And my pretties. Look at this, we got frog's breath. And bat wings. <laughs> now if we just had dead man's toe. Oh, look at this, this is cool. Everlasting life potion. True love potion, that's what I'm talking about. I need someone to fall in love. There's a sparkly spider coming out. How creepy is that? <laughs> Wait a minute, we got a light up candle here. Hold on, hold on. Ooh, look at that. That is cool. You know, I would never buy anything like this, but these look cool. I mean, just to look at them in the store, like look, this is glass, artesian glass. Look at the, uh, what do you call this guy? He's like a wizard, bewitched, argon, spooky. You fools! Candy corn cutie. That's me. This is cool. Look, it looks like a candy house, but it's not really. Oh, and it lights up. Wait, does it? Yeah. Look how cool. 
in the dark you'd see it better but look you can see the lights flashing my favorite color is october <laughs> okay hold on we gotta try me animated clown reaper <laughs> pretty creepy you got awesome looking oh yes this one lights up too does it hold on let's find one that works now oh, these aren't working but maybe you just need batteries or something i don't know sometimes there's a little tab you gotta pull too oh well looks pretty cool anyway though and here's our witch does she do something do you do anything witch Okay. Excuse me, Mrs. Button Eyes, do you do anything? We got some giant pumpkins up here, like the blow molds, only they're just, they're made a different way. They're not really blow molds, but they're just like the, uh, the Jack Skellington ones down there that light up. Okay, this is basic fall stuff right here, and nothing else in here, but we do have a couple things over here yet. Look at these. Those look pretty cool. I mean, I don't know that this is anything that I would ever buy, but it's cool anyway. Stripes, checks, polka dots, and look at these giant things. I bet these light up. Gargoyle. Uh, maybe not. I expected there to be lights in the eyes. They're pretty huge, though. Okay, let's go ahead over here then to the ones that we saw in the middle of the store. Yeah, a bunch of stuff here. I see some things that we didn't see in the aisles there. But let's just start right there. Look at this. This is kind of cool. This is a light-up pumpkin. I don't know if you can... Yeah, you can kind of see the lights in there. That's pretty cool. All these accent pillows. Oh, man. I just, I just love fall. And Halloween especially. But fall, too, is just awesome. Look at these. Count your blessings. Gobble, gobble, gobble. Autumn thankful apple cider. Mm, I could go for some apple cider right now. It'd be so good. Fall leaves gather together. Forget the frost, but everything else is good. I put a spell on you. All right, let's look over here. Look at this. I love fall most of all. That's pretty cool. Hmm. Ooh, straw bales. Yeah, you can't have Halloween without straw bales got to get them from an actual farm though so that there's like big spiders crawling out when you least expect it <laughs> oh my gosh guys look this is like land of the bones over here look at this we got fish bones Ooh, electrical eel that's what it is oh look he lights up along his spine that is cool skeleton fish you remember this guy from finding nemo look at that he lights up on the inside and his little uh whatever you call that thing Here's a full-size skeleton. Now, wait a minute. Okay, yeah, there's one end cap down here that we missed that has full-size skeletons, but that's okay, because we got one right here. So anyway, full-size skeleton. Hello. Hello. Well, that didn't move like I thought it would. <laughs> Little skeletons. Here's skulls. Do they light up? Nope, just basic skulls. $5 for a basic skull. Skeleton dragon. Halloween night owl. Oh, look, he's turning his head. What the heck? <laughs> that does not sound like an owl. Maybe that's how a Halloween night owl sounds, though. If you say so. It sounds like he's saying wow instead of whoo. Okay, here we got some kind of a wiener dog what's to say here buddy bones oh yeah we saw the bigger buddy bones over there look at this a double trouble cobra oh i can't even pull him out of there because he's all wound up but that's pretty cool look he's double headed cobra okay what is this we got an animated rat let's play my favorite scary game time to go squeak <laughs> <laughs> What? Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. That was so <laughs> stupid. The Halloween animated rat. He sounds like Sandy from SpongeBob. Okay, this one apparently lights up. Oh. 
Look, his tail's going, guys. <laughs> that is too funny. Hello, pupster. Okay, here apparently we have a pig with an apple in its mouth. Look at that. What the heck? I wish he lit up or like spit the apple out or something. Okay, wait a minute. We got skeleton octopus. Look at that. I like how they light up inside, not just the eyes. Look at this alien one up here. I can't even get close to him because he's up on the table, but look how cool those eyes look. Aliens. Bird in a cage. Is he animated? Uh, I don't think he's animated. What do we got here? Creepy raven. Eh, he'd be creepier if he was animated or lit up. What in the world is this thing? Gargoyle. Ooh, look at that. Again, I love how they light up on the inside of the bones, not just the eyes. That is pretty cool, I love that. Look at this, guys. Halloween is the only time of year that you can walk into a store and be like, excuse me, do you have any baskets of skeletons? Wicked garden gnomes. Look at this. <laughs> here's our uh, everything else. Oh, here's our skeleton alien. Hello. I don't know if that's how an alien sounds, but... Alright, here we're back to all these colored glass pumpkins. Again, though, guys, look. They look so cool. These would be fun to make. I think. Look at the twisty on this one. That looks really cool. Same on this one here. It's sparkly, too. Mr. and Mrs. Scarecrow. Or something. Sparkly pumpkin. Look at these. These are huge, and it's like a half... Uh, I don't know what the heck. I mean, it's a pumpkin, but it's like a half-rotted pumpkin. Or I guess it could be one that just grew like that. I don't know. I'm a nerd. Whatever. I think that's just about it, guys. Wait, look at this swirly one. Look at the swirly artesian glass pumpkin. That looks pretty cool. I just love that. And then we got tin pumpkins. A couple more things here we didn't really see. Bride and groom tombstone set. Look at that. Mr. and Mrs. They died together. Halloween flamingo. <laughs> and then we got the grave breaker clown. And I think that's just about it, guys. We've been through everywhere so far. Usually they have... Wait a minute, here we go. Here's a boo doormat. Pretty cool. <laughs> Usually they have a lot of stuff set up down here, so I'll bet you anything they've only got about half of it set up right now. Probably going to have a lot more in the near future, so we'll, we will be back when they have more set up. Real quick before we go, let's come down here to this end cap. Yeah, that's all it is. Just full-size skeletons, some more ground breakers, things that we already saw. All right, well... That's trip number two to at home. They usually have a lot of awesome stuff in there. And uh, yeah, they didn't have half of what they did last year. So I guarantee they're not done putting it out yet, which obviously this is July, but, uh, but there is gonna be more coming. So we will make another trip in there very, very soon, guys.